hello friends welcome to the new video of laravel 9 so let's start it so here we are going to use the multi-language web with example so laravel multi-language website how you are going to create it so let's have a tutorial on that so you can see that i have if i go switch english then the text changes french the text changes the spanish the text changes so how we are going to implement it let's have a look okay so let's go to our section so first of all you need to create this is a lang folder okay so i have created three folders in english spanish and the french these three folders should be there and in here we have a messages section so where we have it on the title this one and in the es the title would be the this one and the fr title would be the this one right? correct after moving to the lan lang folder we need to create our resources that uh, first of all lang folder then we go with the routes okay so we have create a group of middlewares which will help us to locate the things so you can see that the change language function i have added and whatever the language is going to be passed so the controller would be the change lang call so let's check out the uh, home controller okay so where is home controller here so app where is uh, HTTP controllers home controller you can see and we have this change language function right so app set location low whatever the code gonna be coming from here then it will put in the session and read right back on that right so this is the language code that we are showing after this route uh, so where we have the views resources views we have the home blade right so you can see that I will word wrap this. Okay. So here is the div for session has lang code, then lang code will be the en, whatever selected else blank. So this is the option selected. So lang code, whatever it is coming, it will go to this uh, change. Whenever you go change one, then it will set in the app set locale section so that we will show the data accordingly. Right. So you have mentioned that on change language, this this is we need to require underscore messages or titles so whatever underscore it will convert the language and show accordingly when we switch to the language and whenever there is a change of language we will hit the change language we will call this uh, route right so this one this route web route this route we are going to change and in the middleware what we have done let's see that one also because it will bypass with the middleware language okay so let's go to the middlewares where we have the language part so you can if the session has language code then set that language code so whatever the language we're going to this middleware help help us to set the language every time when we on change the command okay so after doing this you, you need to go to the kernel.php also that middleware to be added right so you have to create the middleware with the command so which i have which you have added that is php artisan make middleware language you can also make the controller with the help of this one make controller right so after doing this we have the home plate so whatever we are going to change it from here so it will show it and you can create a full-fledged website in the language in laravel line easily or whatever the laravel version you can suggest so you can add it like this one so any query any issue in that just let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day